Hello everyone, Game Dog here, and welcome to Let's Play The Princess Heart by Rose Portal Games. Alright, let's start this out. I'm very curious about this. I think it's a game made of RPG Maker, which, um... Uh, regular window, please. I'm probably never gonna use that, honestly, because uh, of how I record. When not in windowed, regular mode, or to use the mouse, you must move- Oh, this this is mouse controls? Oh, it actually changes my cursor, that's cool. Huh, I've been playing a lot of RPG Maker games that, um, that use the mouse. Anyway, um, the thing that kind of, um, let's see, please do not press F12. Doesn't that reset? Yeah, it does. Alright, there we go. Oh, this looks interesting already. The story is not true. This story is written by an adolescent girl. A girl struggling with her demons, a beautiful girl with darkness in her heart and on her mind, but with wishes of purity. With pen and paper, she creates a world, a world where her dreams may come true. A world twisted by the addiction in her soul. Follow the story into the princess's heart as she travels her own written reality. Aberta. Okay, these are all default VX Ace assets. I believe that mugshot even is too. Huh, interesting. Not sure how I feel about that so far, but it certainly looks interesting. I like the music. Wonder if that's um pre bot or something, but whatever. Sir Gavin, he, uh, be prepared for to um to assault the guards if they do not let us through. My princess, are you certain you wish to continue with this? I like that mugshot a lot too. I forgot what that guy's name was. The King and Queen of uh, Swansea may perceive it as, as an act of hostility. You do not tell me what to do. He will pay for what he has done to me. This game, re okay, I already this game really loves to throw attacks around. With all due respect, with a mi uh, when a mind is closed by wine, one cannot make proper judgments. Cease your arguments, Captain. You're under my command. Now, the writing is pretty good so far. It's it's kind of typical medieval, but I like it a lot. I'm a, prince of, a princess of L Lon Londonia, and I demand to speak with the King Queen of Swansea. An audience with His Excellency must be requested at the Royal Office of Administration. What evidence have you um, being a, um, of you being a Princess Air Arian of Londaria? I might butcher some names, by the way. <laughs> you guys know me and my proper nouns at this point. Who do I look like? Some cheap tavern wench? No, of course not. No one will stop me from speaking with the king and queen. Gavin, kill them. My princess, I strongly suggest if you not obey my orders, I shall grant uh, get through, through them myself. And I wonder what my parents would do if uh, they were found out you let me get hurt. I like how the characters flash when they talk. That's a cool attention to the detail. Or some of them do. If you stand no chance with the four um, of you against the entire guards, just you leave the castle now. Alright, first battle already. Ooh. Huh. Switch between active party members. Yeah, it's got this again, but I think what you gotta do is gotta do... Oh, this one's an auto battle feature, too. Um, okay, this is pretty default so far, but I kind of like it. Um, nothing wrong with default. Oh, it's kind of turn-based, too. Oh, you can choose the order they go in. That's cool. That's kind of creative, actually. Here's Ally's physical attack for five turns. And no skills quite yet. I'm assuming both those guards are filler characters. That's cool, so I can kind of prioritize um, who goes first. So I can use like heals first and the like. Using journey points acquired from leveling up and completing quests to learn new skills and spells in the learn skill menu. Okay, so it's got the job point plugin. Um, or I guess script since this is VX Ace. Go there now by selecting skills from the main menu and unlock Princess Aragon's first magical spell. Uh, why is it telling me about the screen sky size again? We will be hung for this. My life is over. You surrender your life to, um, to the throne where you took your vows as guards. Huh. So I'm assuming I can click on these. Uh, does X work, though? Yes, it does, and honestly, that's probably what I'm going to be using. Um, so skills. Learn skills. I can learn fire, ice, thunder. Let's see. 
Okay, so it's got the typical, like, um... One's a typical... I'll go for, for ice, because you guys know I like ice magic. One that's, like, stronger, and then one's that, that's kind of in the middle, but it hits everyone. Okay, that's that's respectable. I like that. Uh, what about these two, these guys, too? Ooh, that's nice. And they don't have anything. Oh, no, they do have stuff. Maybe they aren't filler characters. I'll go for that. I'll also learn it. What do we got? See, they've, uh, they've also, um... Let's see. The Princess and Soul of her London issues. Parameters. Properties. Oh, that's neat. I think I know exactly what script this is, but that's cool anyway. <laughs> you know, the thing is, once you've played enough RPG Maker games, and once you've actually used RPG Maker a lot yourself, you, you start to pick these things out. Like, I think I can name every single plugin this game has used up to this point. Heck, I think even um, after the end, I'll also use these as well. Let's go ahead and save... Honestly, I I far prefer. Oh, that's an auto save. Oh, cool. Not enough game. Not enough of these games use auto save. Hmm. Oh, oh, it's got walking into monsters. Okay, that's good. So a little while ago, I bought um. I got a um. I got like you know those like um those like humble bundles, those kinds of sites. Um, I bought a bundle a little while ago that had a bunch of RPG Maker assets in it. You guys, as you guys know, I'm, I like RPG Maker a lot, and I'm trying to actually build a game of it right now. Um, and this, uh, it, it came with like XP and a couple other things I've always wanted to try, and it also came with a few games also made of RPG Maker, and this is one of them. It looked interesting. I don't know why this specifically stuck out to me, but I kind of want to try it. Oh, another problem I see too. Um, please tell me there's an option menu where I can turn this on. Doesn't appear to be it, but um, it does appear actually this might be the normal running speed i've been using mv for so long that actually i think is just like bigger so it looks like guys are moving faster i'm not sure if this is normal walking speed or not hmm so it appears to have the, uh, the chase player option uh let's see let's try ice out i like that effect right there the circles that's good doesn't use too much mp either so uh, oh boy um I'll have you... Just all of you attack? Yeah, I'll heal him after the battle. I don't think there's any way he's gonna kill him. Ah, uh, that one's locked. I'm just looking around for stuff right now. You never know. You never know when any of these first stuff might be, um... Does that hurt me? No, those tiles usually hurt you. <laughs> Pretty sure these tiles usually hurt you as well. You know, it's really interesting seeing all the default stuff used like this. Or, like, honestly, I, I've been using this tile set for, for quite some time, too, and it's it's always cool to see what other people do with it. Wait, he didn't heal. Oh, no, I think I used them on the wrong character, the healing items. You know what I could do? Um, let's go for special. Oh, no, that's the other guy that has him. Okay, no, the other guard. I was thinking I could maybe have one character take all of the damage, um, so that, uh... Oh, no, no, no. Uh, so then I wouldn't have to use, like, more than two potions. These enemies seem to appear to drop them enough anyway, and games like this usually have potions very frequent to begin with, so... Probably don't need to min-max that much. Ooh, level ups. I am not old yet. Okay. Yeah, you get, like, two or three potions per encounter, so it's not really a worry I have right now. Oh, it looks like they heal automatically after battle, too. Didn't even notice that at first. Either that or a level up fully heals you, which is always something I like. Halt, you have no permission to be here. I need no permission. Before you stands the Princess of Londonia. Uh, you have committed an act of hostility towards the Crown of Swansea, and will hereby be taken captive. Alright, uh, boss fight. Thankfully I leveled up. Um, why does he always have it? Oh, that's a bit strange. Wait, is that an AoE thing? Oh, that's cool! <laughs> I 
I didn't expect that. If you look at the Steam Store page, um, the game specifically lists um, Final Fantasy, I think, 3 as a as a, um, as an inspiration, as well as uh, the one that really caught my eye, Earthbound, because you guys know I like Earthbound likes. Let me tell you, if that is the case, this is probably the least Earthbound-like I've seen... Uh, er, yeah, this is probably the least Earthbound-like Earthbound-like I've seen yet, but... I don't know, that might have just been the buzzword. <laughs> you never know. I should I should just keep using magical for oh critical nice. Boom. I like Earthbound likes is what I'm trying to say. Oh now we can move diagonally. Oh they're not even here. We should turn back now, my princess, before the entire guard descends upon us. He broke my heart. Once I tell his parents, he'll be punished for an in, um for for his indefinitely. This is absurd. Remember your place, Captain. Oh boy. You dare question by the purity of uh, of our beloved prince? That him? <laughs> Tommy Harden Hardris. Uh what are you doing here? I know what you did. Uh what do you mean? We should t we should talk in private. You shared your bed with another woman. That is not true. Stop lying. I'm leaving. Okay. Commander, take this ca um, take them captive. Tell the King of Londonia to pick up his daughter. No, wait, I'm sorry. Huh. It was sort of a, a love plot. Uh, was placed in solitary captivity. Um, where Fazes conveyed the errors. Okay. Okay, I got. I get what's going on. Ooh. So the uh, so so the arbitrary escape from jail scene is going to be the first thing we do. Okay. You can't lock me in here. I did nothing wrong. I only want to see him, talk to him, and 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 punch him. They can't keep me here. Father will get out. Will get me out. Tommy has to understand. He um he was the one who dis disloyal to me. I need a drink. I need to drink something. That's out of nowhere. Do you hear me? I'm thirsty. Guards, bring me wine. Guards. There must be something in this room. There's nothing. Damn them all to hell. Where is Thorny? Bring me Th Th Thorny? Thorny? Oh no, Thorny. I wish to speak with him. It's a weird name, but... Need a drink. Need... I don't want... What? Really? Come any minute now, unless they didn't ask him to come. We fading away. Uh, where the hell is he? What's he ta uh, What's taking him so long? That worthless boy is always late. I can't trust... You can't trust him. He can't. You're worthless, do you hear me? I'm throwing you in the dungeon when I'm out of here. And Tommy will lovely, love me. I did nothing wrong. Do you hear me? What have I done? I've hit a man. I've hit a man I love. I've done everything wrong. And I, am I even sure that he slept with another woman? Maybe he didn't. What do I really know? Oh God, forgive me. I have been so stupid. Please let him forgive me. He, um, he's a love of my life. I can't lose him. Wow, you okay? <laughs> you know, for as much as like our as I like RPG Maker, that was made with like the default character design, like option, which I am not a huge fan of. I it, it's always weird to me how uncomfortably their mugshots always just stare at you. <laughs> I think the MV one is much better personally, but wow, you look bad. What happened? Ah, uh, never mind. I probably know more than uh, than you at the moment. I've done everything wrong. Oh, he was in the room with us. I've never, um, I'm never drinking again. It's all because of the alcohol. What's his last name? Mwangi? Thani Mwangi. Huh. Uh, we've said that quite, uh, quite a few times already. The two guards he brought you with the, um, with you at were, 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 um, were executed there. Sir Gavin has been demoted, um, to your personal bodyguard. My bodyguard? I just don't, um, just to me, just to make sure I don't run off again? Actually, you're being taken to Volwall by him. Your parents' orders. They want you to um to re to rehabilitate. What Volwall? That's disgusting. My pla my place is here in the city. Can you go with me? Sure. I had um I had a feeling you would ask me that of me. I can't see your face in this darkness. Your head looks like uh, two floating eyes. Um, come on. Let's uh let's get ready. We uh we need to leave in the um on the morrow. One week later. All right.
Carson... Carson Cottage. I managed to um to take some potions from a uh, Linquan stash. Now we just need to get uh, into the forest without Sir Gavin following me. And if we need more, uh, we we can sell the items uh, from creatures we defeat for money. All right, then let's make our way to the crypt. I don't know where it is though, somewhere north of the forest. But it shouldn't be a problem. We just need to try to avoid the hostile creatures in the forest. There still hasn't been any word, right? Yes, I think Tom is ignoring your letters. I need to meet with it. Okay. Is Duel Kalog? If the stories are true, he can uh, help me win back my love. Sounds good. So, 10 potions and. Okay. Hold down the shift key to run um, in a safe area without enemies. Go into the options menu to see the. Auto to set the oh, good, good, good. Okay. Um, I want to set this to automatic. Where's the options menu? Is it system? Yes, it is. Auto dash on. Ugh. Not enough games do that. Um, you guys know my rule. I like a dark blue uh, or a dark green. Oh, that is slow. You know, as a protest, not really a protest, but something kind of bothers me when a game uh, does absolutely nothing. Um, like they just put in this option without even thinking about it. That, that's dark green enough. That looks a little ugly. That looks like pea soupy, but I, I'll deal with it for now. What is this, a save point? A rest point? No, it's a rest point. Okay. <laughs> Something I like to do is to set the option to the ugliest one I can find and then just deal with it. <laughs> and then, then that, that, like, that'll annoy people or something, but whatever. Dark green is fine. I might change it later, but uh, what do we got? I like the menu sounds. It changed up a little bit. Let's see. Okay, so we have... A yeah. Averin and Thani. I'm not sure if I like these names so far. They're kind of weird. She has a club. Okay, that's uh, interesting. And you have a staff. I notice I can't change the weapon. That might, They might be plot relevant. Uh, let's see. An apprentice of the Cleric of the Night. He is at, adept at magic, but not. But um, has a clouded mind. Sounds like my kind of character. Let's see. Quest. No quest lot yet, except for the main one, obviously. I go like, um, I want to see what you got. You have nothing. You can learn a lot, though. Oh, my goodness. Okay, fire break. Um... Ooh. Oh, those look cool. We're in a forest right now, so I'm probably going to try and prioritize some, uh, some like, fire stuff. Transfer health to an ally. You'll monitor divine damage. Darkness. Sleep on a target and grill over their magical defense. That sounds... I might save up for Nightmare, honestly. I like the moves like that. Okay, well... You guys know a golden rule of mine. I always like to keep the first episode short-ish, uh, just so I can make sure it records right. That in mind, I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.